Hey Earth Signs, welcome to my channel. This is your Sunday, July 15th, 2018 Daily Love Forecast. Um, this is for Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We'll see what we got for the energy of the day. How are you guys handling this eclipse energy? Are you guys feeling kind of blah, kind of weird? Not sad, not depressed, but just kind of digging up memories of the past. For a group of you, that is the case because I'm seeing you're getting stuck in your head a little bit about it. It's going to be okay. This energy will pass. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in that order. Okay, we're going to do one more shuffle. Could be hearing from a soulmate, I'm hearing. Um, okay, bottom of the deck, two of wands. You were at a crossroads. Ooh, endings of relationships. Um, not feeling stable in your in your home, in your foundation. Feels like it's shaking underneath you, guys. With the two of wands in reverse as well, you're, you are at a crossroads. A decision has been made. However, you're picking a path and you're walking in that direction. Let's hope it's it's what best serves you. Taurus males, what do we got? Taurus females. Virgo males. Virgo females. Capricorn males. Okay. Your bottom of the clarifying deck, the six of wands, finding victory. You guys are picking the path. You guys are following your heart. What makes you happy? Um, what makes you passionate? What you find success in? Awesome. Taurus, you guys are putting up a fight. You don't want somebody to pick a different path than you. You have been battling for a long time with this person, trying to keep them in your space. Taurus males, you are trying to keep a divorce from happening. You um, also, the karmic scales are out of balance. Uh, you could be suffering some bad karma right now. Taurus females, you are most definitely trying to keep a relationship from ending. This is something that you have put a lot of battle into, a lot of work for. But the seed has been planted. The tower will fall. The more you fight it, the harder it is. So um, let that tower come down and then move forward in the path that is picked for you. You will find victory if you don't fight this. This is karma you both males and females are dealing with. Um, quit fighting what is meant. Quit fighting destiny um, because you're creating uh you're creating a lot of hurt in yourself um instead of allowing this to um exit your life and then to heal you're continuing the pain so let that pain go move forward and and find success in that virgos you guys are creating something new um you have decided to take the path less traveled and to follow your passion and a new creative spark is going to bring you success um, males, you have a choice to make. Look at that. Two of wands and two of swords. You guys think you have to choose between two things? I think so. Pick the one that, uh, brings creativity to your life. Pick the one who you feel that you can create something new with, um, and, and be successful. And I do see you doing that with the six of wands on the bottom. Um, Virgo females, you guys are bored. You guys need something, um, to, to uh, spice up your life a little bit. But remember, the grass is not always greener on the other side. It's The grass is always greener where you water it. So um, don't concentrate on what you lost. Concentrate on the blessings you have in front of you because you have a new uh, beginning with somebody that is going to uh, allow you to create something that you're very passionate about. Capricorns, uh-oh. Seven of Swords. Capricorn males, five of wands, you have somebody uh, confronting you about some uh, deceit in the past, and you're going to have to decide whether to uh, 
try to stay and work on this relationship or to let this relationship go. Capricorn females, um, you could be deceiving yourself at work, self-sabotage uh, with a creation uh, of a business possibly. Also, for a group of you, there's a third party that you were cheating on or you were um, sneaking around with in the past. That is coming to an end because they are picking a path that's not your, you um, for a small group of you. But a lot of this is work for you, Capricorn females. But yeah, no matter, there's deceit in your life somewhere, guys. Because um, there is a third party here too. It could be with a Virgo uh, male. I don't know why that pops out, but yeah, a Virgo male and a Taurus female, maybe. Yeah, for a group of you, you could have been in a third party with a, a, a Virgo male that has a Taurus spouse. They're going to um, pick a path real shortly, real soon, especially if you're the Virgo male. He's got, got the choice here. Uh, yeah, that's that's crazy how them all three just link together like that. Let me get you guys an advice card for Sunday. What advice do you have for our earth signs for Sunday the 15th, please? And thank you. The sun dancers. Beautiful card. Joyful activity. Celebration of life. Abundance. Allow true happiness. Follow your heart. Um, that is the most important. And when you're with the empress, especially for you Virgos, when you are doing something that you love, that you're passionate about, that you have a fresh spark about, and a creation that you yourself created, it's it's so joyful. It brings pure joy to your life. Joy is different than happiness. Um, and it's going to bring a true celebration of life. You're going to have something that you are happy about, that you are happy or proud of, and it's going to bring you abundance as well. You can't beat that. Angels, what advice do you have? There we go. That was quick. Keep an open mind and worth waiting for. Holy cow. Holy cow. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Wow. Soulmates and twin flames are coming in for you, earth signs. Um, keep an open mind. They may not be who you think they are. You could most definitely be thinking that it is somebody else. And then someone new is going to come into your life. And you're going to be like, wait a minute. Worth waiting for. This person, yeah, it's going to bring you joy. It's going to bring you celebration and abundance. So Taurus, you guys definitely let go of those relationships that you're trying to struggle to hold on to. They're ending anyways for a large group of you because the tower is there and justice is there. That's karma and, uh, and fate, destiny. Um, because you guys have soulmates coming in. Virgos. Yeah, you guys have twin flame soulmates in your immediate energy right now. And Capricorns. Allow that hurt from the deceit of the past to go. Heal from that. So your soulmates can come in. Beautiful Sunday for you, Earth Signs. Um, yeah, for sure. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed your Sunday reading. As always, I send you love, light. I'll see you next time.